guys, it's Queen Deja, and in today's video, I will be reacting for you to episode 22 of Delicious Party Pretty Curious. Let's go ahead and get started in 3, 2, 1, go. Mm, I feel bad for him. You gotta. Mm. Wait. Do you know? Hold up. <laughs> okay. Okay. We'll talk about it more in the opening. See, I love that he he feels like he's useless. Um, I mean, because, no offense, there have been times where he did feel a little useless. I mean, once again, 22 episodes into this show. So I, I completely understand where he's like, maybe I should retire and stuff, and maybe I should just quit. But something something else is also going to happen in this episode where he's just like, no. I'm gonna keep going so we still hope he gets a better you know storyline that is somewhat similar to tuxedo mask because you know mm, like i said last week because oh your, your girl meant every single word i said last week because mm. Mm. Did I ever show you guys? Well, I don't think I did because I'm looking at it right now. Well, we'll show it at the end. Mm, okay. But you don't know which one? Mm. Yeah, you will definitely know. <laughs> oh 
Holy. <laughs> Girl, that's the whole kitchen. <laughs> Of course. <laughs> She's just more evolved now. <laughs> I know. Even though I feel like this is going to be a talking center focus episode, I feel like we're going to get the Yui talking dynamic that I have been wanting, like, for a while. Because, once again, we all know that he has the biggest crush on her. And I want this series to end with these two, you know, officially, like, saying, hey, we're together! Like, it'd be sweet. I'm just, I'm just saying. Please. I'm a fucking hopeless romantic. Like, come on. Too crispy. Okay, so then if that doesn't work, we use cake flour. It's pretty. See, look at them. They're flirting and they just know it. Like, uh, oh. See, you know, I'm kind of now in the mood for crepes, but I'm going to have nachos for dinner tonight again. Um, 
But, like, you know how you, when you want, like, a really good authentic thing? Like, I, I've had grapes, especially, like, when you go to, like, Denny's or whatever. But, like, ooh, I just, you know, I really want some good authentic ass grapes. Like, oh, my God. Yeah. Uh-oh. And apologize, of course. No, oh my God, talk to me. No, hmm. <laughs> see, it's like this. I've seen that crystal sugar bottle thing on like Amazon Japan and a couple of places. I won't went so bad. Just how, you know, the it's over here. You just can't see it. If you follow me on Twitter, you, like, I've posted, like, the screenshot and everything of it of what I have for this series. I just haven't, you know, like, modeled with it and be like, oh, look, it's so pretty. Like, ah. Oh. But you know how you want something for, like, the aesthetic? I want it so bad. And your girl might buy it the next time she gets paid. Because at the same time, I gotta save money. <laughs> Go on. <laughs> oh, he's so cute. <laughs> Damn, they still haven't changed the eye of the eye catch that of the Anamane. Twenty two episodes, man. Maybe at the twenty five minute mark, maybe? I mean it would make sense. I mean, you have all four girls, so why are we waiting? <laughs> no, talk to me. Oh, finally! Oh, all four together! Yes! Yes! Finally!
Even though I still kind of wish, you know, they had Amane on her own because her music is, oh, beautiful and godlike. Like, oh, just, it's okay, though. Mm hmm Like the one at the beginning of the episode. Yeah, plus it still has the teaspoons. And no, yeah, don't let your guard down. Finally said it. Uh -huh. My thing is like, why don't you attack her from the back? But mm. oh. The fact that he finally had a move with the name today, like, oof. Everything, like, thank you.
I still want them earrings so bad. Oh, Come on, come on. So fucking cute. Oh my god! when they have to depart. Mm-hmm. That's so fucking cute. For then watch, like Yui's gonna come over and then she's gonna find out but like ah Well, you can already tell that next week's going to be a coconut-focused episode. I'm not mad at it. But for a Yui and Takumi-focused episode, but mainly, mostly a Takumi-focused episode, I think this was something that was needed a lot. Because, once again, since he is, like, the quote-unquote equivalent to Tuxedo Mask in this show, we know that he has to, like get some episodes focused on him. And I'm glad he has, like, an episode or two focused on him. It's really interesting. Um, especially where he, you know, felt like, I, like, genuinely, I felt like by the midway point, um, he was gonna quit and be like, yeah, what dude said, he's right, I'm only really here and I'm useless, da 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 But, I mean, you know, because his girlfriend, a.k.a. Yui, you know, helping him with some crepes and everything. You know, I think in that way and being useful towards the two friends, um, who obviously also look like a couple to me as well. Because hopefully we get a little bit of answers on that soon later on in the series. Because, of course, they're going to be characters that are possibly going to get another mention in a different episode in the future. Maybe. Who knows? That, you know, yeah, coming in and doing this, it's not a wrong thing. You're, you're doing it because you want someone to be happy. And it's sweet. And I'm glad he didn't quit. Very good episode. Like, oof, give me another one. That's all. That's all I need. Give me another talk of me focus episode. But I love the fact that Kokone is getting her focus next week. Whatever the heck it's going to be about. Oh, my mom's pretty! Bruh, her mom looks like, oh my god, <laughs> her mom, like, gives me the way that she, like, her outfit and her dress. It's very similar to Cure Midnight, um, and then a little bit of Cure Mermaid herself, so hella giving me Go Princess and, um, happiness, no, heart catch, mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. uh, decade. Yep. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I wouldn't be surprised if she's maybe voiced by Nana Mizuki. If Nana Mizuki wants to come back, you know, hint, hint, nudge, nudge. But you know, Nana Mizuki came back for Tropical Rouge Pretty Cure. So, um, yeah. But it would be nice. So whoever she's voiced by next week, I'll, I'll be excited no matter who it is. Um, but she also gives me like hella vibes to, um, my best girl's mom from Is the Order a Rabbit and such. And I'm just like, oh, like, oh my god. Like, yeah. You look like you might be voiced by Nana Mizuki. Like, ooh, ooh, ooh. I don't know. I just, I kind of want it. I love seeing or having, like, people from the Pretty Cure universe who eventually kind of maybe come back to voice, like, a non- character who's not a cure like the parent of the cure i think that'll be a really sweet idea yeah they could do that i mean heck you had like for the last couple the big thing from last year was having nico from love live um 
voicing the teacher for a whole year and so we had a whole like one minute it was either we uh, it was either me freaking about <laughs> freaking out about like um everybody in the cast and stuff every single week and then hearing when someone told me oh hey yeah you know nico's in this show and i was like nico from love live like oh that's even better like ish and, and then we get to this season and, and <laughs> it went from i don't know like <laughs> no it went from oh my god it's freaking miku from simple gear to oh my god it's alex from seo slash what's it <laughs> what's the face of simple gear and that's all it is every single week with me and always being in the simple gear fields but yeah i mean hopefully whoever she is voiced by um i'm guessing the note that she is writing to is to her parents because of the fact is kopane is always by herself so she does feel lonely in some sort of way very similar to um kiraqua and yes yeah, pretty here five especially with her situation on her parents and because she is a um, a rich girl who has very successful famous parents who also have their own jobs and careers that you know yeah sometimes it is hard to balance both but um yeah hold up give me one second so about a month ago um I gotta open it up the opposite way so as I was saying about a month ago I was on um Amazon Japan of course <laughs> like you know the majority of all of us are you know you go on somewhere and you're like hmm you know let me see what this amazon you know or just something amazon has and stuff and you know of course because it's amazon japan and you can like literally get stuff from amazon japan and because we are in this season of pretty cure and normally like i think ever since um kitty kitty pretty girl mode when i bought the sweets pack and cure um parfait's wine like i already knew i i was magical girl trash and then <laughs> i there there's not really any other series like that i've bought magical girl items and stuff because they're like so freaking cute i mean they're like i there's some there's a lot of other magical girl items from pretty cure that i really really want and stuff but like it's super hard to find them whether you're going on amazon japan or mccarthy or something and sometimes it could be expensive like i was super close to um buying cure felice aka my favorite cure of really she's my number one um her wand but i missed it by just this much but so uh, this took about almost a couple of weeks for it to arrive. We had a little problem with it because it was all the way in California. And I was wondering where the heck this thing was. And by the time it came to me, the box that I had for it um, wasn't really the greatest. Uh, and um, the box was kind of opened and stuff. But I was like, that's okay. I just need to see if the item is open. And thank God it wasn't. But here she is. This thing is so fucking cute. It's so fucking detailed and gorgeous as heck. I have the necklace as well, but I wasn't expecting it to be, like, in my hands. It is, like, freaking small. Very, very small and very, like, dainty and, like, I can't fit. Like, I can fit my arm in there and everything like that and stuff. Like, get a good behind grip on it. I don't have batteries in it yet um, because I've been trying to find AAA batteries around my house, I know, but it is so freaking detailed. The day I got it, I was on, um, uh, <laughs> a live party stream with my friend, and I was just fangirling over it, because I, the same day, of course, I had to go to work, and when I got it, I just, I was like, oh my god, <laughs> it's here, and like I said, there's a couple other things from this series, and a couple other pretty cure series that I really do want like I said the sugar crystal things um which of course is just candy but when I saw it online I was just like that's cute I need it and such but I love the fact that I have it it's gorgeous the necklace the necklace is cute I know they have like another one that's like still very wearable and because now I wear um technically like i also wear like anime shirts when i'm out work and stuff but that's eventually going to change because my new managers went to want us to wear like uniforms that's to make professionals but you know with my car captain's a car bracelet 
I've received so many freaking compliments on that. And they're like, oh, where did you get that from? And I'm like, Haha, you know, third party website. <laughs> but I love wearing things that are very subtle to anime where it's like not always out there. Even though I love wearing my shirts and supporting like keychains on my lanyards and everything. It's just super adorable. And everyone's like, oh, hey, you must really like that. I'm like, yes, I do. <laughs> but going back to this episode and the weapon. Yes, love, love, love this episode. I really hope that we get another episode continuing on Takumi's um, story and everything because he, see he still is a very important character to this series. It's very vital. So fingers crossed we do get that in the near future. But other than that, guys, that is my reaction view towards episode 22 of Delicious Party Pretty Cure. If you guys enjoyed it, please give me a like. It really helps me out. Also, subscribe to my channel. I make videos every single day. Join the Master Squad. And, of course, I will see you guys officially all either next Saturday or next Sunday for episode 23. Bye, guys.